Kim and I have spent years educating newcomers to the art and craft of mosaic making. We know getting started can be the hardest part, so we teamed up and created these beautiful mosaic kits to help jumpstart the process for you. With simple and attractive designs to suit any taste, your kit includes detailed instructions and all the materials you'll need to get started. Let's take a look inside our contemporary glass kit. This is the pear pattern. Inside, we find a color reference guide that shows cutting patterns and colors, detailed instructions, carbon paper for transferring your design. Here's all of our beautiful tiles. Oh my goodness. And there's even a little bag of practice tiles so you can practice cutting before you start. Glue and a paintbrush for application. Sponge for cleanup and grouting. And of course our grout. And here's our pattern. And a beautiful handmade wood frame that you can finish the edges any way you like. Stain, paint, or just even a clear finish. It's a good idea to paint or stain the frame before you start working in your mosaic. For this frame, I used a black paint. Use the transfer paper to trace your pattern onto the frame. The wheels of the tool face in towards your navel. Whether you're right-handed or left-handed does not matter. Like all compression tools, these work best if your hand is towards the end of the handle. For those first cuts, hold the tile firmly between your fingers, firmly squeeze, and cut the tile in half. Then, cut the tile in half again. Included in your kit is a bag of practice tiles. Begin cutting those. For finer nipping, move your hand up the tool a bit. This will make it easier to cut those finer nuanced pieces. And remember, with these glass tiles, the ridge is actually the back side of the tile. The flat is the front side. Where to start? Begin in the center or find a focal point. Don't begin at the edges. Once you have a few tiles in place and you're happy with them, glue them down. The glue we are using is a white PVA glue, well bond. It's water soluble and non-toxic. You can put the glue directly on the board or you can individually back butter each piece. Take your time and have fun. Your glue needs to dry at least 12 hours before grouting. Be sure to read the directions before grouting. Set up a workspace and wear a mask when mixing. We gave you more grout than you will need, and we recommend you reserve a little in case you need a repair. We have several videos on the channel about the grouting process. See the description below for details. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And remember, life's a mosaic, you pick the pieces.